and welcome back to my channel Simply Queen by Sherelle. That's me, the seamstress. Today's video, I will show you how I am going to uh, re-upholster my new drafting chair. So this chair is going to be used in my sewing studio. So I recently um, redid my studio and removed uh, the tables that I had in there in which my sewing machines were on and replace them with kitchen cabinets and a countertop. So the cabinets are 30, 35 inches high and then the countertop is an additional inch and a half. So that's 36 and a half inches high. That's the height of my um, current sewing counters. So the chair that you see here, this brown um, office chair here is what I was using. And this is a great chair. I purchased this chair from at home and the way that the back rest um, is on this chair it it's it hits you right in your lumbar um, area of your back and the support was mm, awesome so I really hate losing this chair but it is not going to work for me because I have to have a um, chair that is um, a, a way taller and the only um, chairs out there that can accommodate such um, you know a, a height is um, they're called drafting chairs so I purchased this drafting chair from Hobby Lobby and it's regularly regularly $99.99 and I got it for um, $74.99 and for those of you who do not know Hobby Lobby no longer has the 40% off coupon. And even if they did still have the 40% off coupon, the coupons are not valid on um, th these chairs. So I, either way, I would have had to pay um, $74.99 uh, for it. So my plan is to, uh, before we even put it together, is I am going to take the... Um, the bottom cushion and the back uh, cushion and I am going to cover them with this uh, fabric here um, and the fabric this is uh, outdoor fabric or shall I say upholstery fabric it's pretty thick it's not cotton well it's cotton but it's 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 like the um, outdoor fabric I am going to cover my new chair with this fabric I thought that was very cute okay so um, I think I've come up with um, the way that I want to try and accomplish you know um, the project so we'll get we'll give it a shot and, and see what happens so so yeah so that's what I'm going to do I'm going to go ahead and cover these two pieces and then I will um, you know have the chair put together a little bit later so the first thing I am going to do is I am going to measure both the seat cushion and the backrest um, I'm going to measure it all the way around um, the diameter of it and the width of it and then I will cut cut it um, an additional inch longer uh, all the way around and then I am going to start um, uh, covering covering the chair okay so I'll come back and show you my progress <music> 